All right, Claire, let's check out some of your first run at Stratton GS. We'll watch it in regular motion uh, and then slow it down. Take it out a little slower. Um, you know, some good skiing, but if we can make it better. Obviously, we've got to be, you know, strong on the outside ski. Here, you kind of leaned in, weight on the inside, and fell to the inside. Good recovery, though. Um, a couple things you look for in, in really good skiing is having motion, meaning um, moving through the transition. Um, and you're kind of skiing a little staticky, so instead of standing up straight and not a lot of motion. Um, so you come through here, the transition, just kind of stand up straight the whole way. You want to try to, through the transition, um, you know, transfer weight to the new, up, new outside ski, which is currently uphill. Get your center mass over it and then move along that ski so we get hips up over the boots at the top of the turn. So we need more motion, um, and we clearly need more angles. We, we've got to uh, put those skis up on, on more of an edge and really pressure that outside ski. Um, so when we're talking about angles, you know, we're talking about, um, you can see your, your angle here is, is like that. Um, you know, and we're looking for upper and lower body separation. So coming here with the upper body and the feet go out here allows us to really pressure the outside ski. Um, leaning in like that, it's really weight on both skis. This is very called two-footed. You're you are turning on both skis, weighting both skis, almost equal equal weight on both skis. We got to be practically. 100% of the outside ski. See again there, just not, not getting the angle. So the skis up aren't, aren't, aren't up on edge, so they kind of skid. Until we get them up on edge, we gotta, gotta produce a high edge angle platform then to really push against, all right? So yours is kind of flat and they're just kind of skidding a little bit. But you got some good other things going on. Nice, nice width of the feet is good. You got a pole plant. Hands are out in front more or less. You just really got to have some more motion. We've got to produce bigger edge angles and angles of our body, lower upper body separation. Um, it's going to come first in free skiing. You got to really roll those both both feet up both uh, you know using ankles and knees get those up on edge high push against them and then you can move the hip into the center of in, in, to the inside or the kind of center of the arc of the turn trying to get those feet out from beneath us and producing that upper and lower body separation uh, drills that help you know like a slopey drill um, do a lot of those and uh, that should help you out